Okay, I'm having to bring in my cymbidiums because it's snowing out here. So I usually leave these out until um, it drops below freezing or I guess it's snowing. And even though we haven't hit Halloween yet, it's now snowing in Chicago. So these guys are coming in. They fell over last night, I guess from the wind. So here's how my cymbidiums look right now as they get snowed on. My cymbidiums are now in my three season sunroom. So they're still cool. And I have a few other blooming plants in here with them. But um, I wanted to just look over them really quick uh, and see if I see any spikes on my cymbidiums or nubs that could become spikes. So here's a little nub. Um, I can't tell yet. I suspect because of the split right there that it's probably a new growth and not a spike. Um, and I don't see any other ones on this one and then over here uh this one has nothing i see nothing on it here we've got something i don't know could be a spike strangely rippled right there we'll have to wait and find out and then this is my tracianum over here. See if we see anything. Oh, wait, it's got, it's got a little nub right here. Um, and got a little nub right here, or big nub. Um, so could have spikes on this. And then finally, this over here is um, a Cymbidium Dorothy Stockstill. And I am thinking it doesn't see, well, wait, wait. I was gonna say nothing, but then here's this little nublet right there. So maybe, maybe it'll spike. Um, that'll be a spike. Um, they're kind of small to be able to discern if they're spikes or not yet, but I'm hopeful. So that's the state of my cymbidium chilling um, after I had to bring them in because it was snowing.